good morning today i am going to discuss about the topic transgenic animals transgenic animals are the animals that have had a foreign gene deliberately inserted to their genome and this is commonly created by micro injection of dna into the pronuclei of a fertilized egg which is subsequently implanted into the oviduct of a pseudo pregnant mother and here we are going to discuss about transgenic fish transgenic chicken rabbit sheep goat pig cow and about primates so first of all let's discuss about transgenic insect this is an insect that has been genetically modified either through mutagenesis or through the process of transgenesis or cisgenesis motivations for using genetically modified insects include biological research purposes and genetic pest management sit or sterile insect technique was developed conceptually in 1930s and 40s and it is first used in the environment in 1950s it is a control strategy where male insects are sterilized and this is usually done by eradic irradiation then this sterilized males are released to mate with a wild female if enough males are released this female will mate with mostly sterile males males and it will lay non viable eggs so this will create a population of insect to crash and in some cases this can lead to local eradication irradiation means it is a form of mutagenesis which causes random mutation in dna another control strategy is the ridl that means release of insects carrying dominant lethals here uh, using a genetically engineered insects that have carry a lethal gene in their genome this lethal genes will cause death in an organism this ridl genes will only kill young insect usually in the larval or pupal stage similar to how inheritance of brown eyes is dominant to blue eyes this lethal gene is dominant so that all offsprings of the ridl insect will also inherit the lethal gene and this lethal gene has a molecular on and off switch which allow this ridl insects to be reared this gene will turned off when this insects are mass reared in an insectary and it will turned on when they are released into the environment this ridl males and females are released to mate with wild males and their offsprings die when they reach the larval or pupal stage because of the presence of this lethal gene and this also will cause the insects to crash so this technique is been developed for some insects and for other insect have been tested in the field and scientists say that introduction of genetically modified mosquitoes will lower the population of disease carrying biting insects over the time so field testing of the gmo mosquito has not found in any significant impact on humans this is the transgenic fish transgenic fish means a fish which carry one or more foreign genes the gene transfers have been successful in several fishes for example common carp rainbow trout atlantic salmon catfish dogfish etc here the introduced genes include the human or art gene for growth hormone chicken gene for delta crystalline protein e coli gene for beta galacto galactosidase etc and winter flounder gene for anti freeze protein this anti freeze protein gene of polar flounders was transferred to transgenic atlantic salmon and it will help in promoting resistance to the low pro, uh, low temperature of ice waters in the salmon so that the habitat of the atlantic salmon may be extended to polar waters and this technique of micro injection has been successfully used to used to generate transgenic fish in many species 
usually direct micro injection of a cloned dna into male pronuclei of the fertilized egg have proved very successful but in most of the species studied so far pronuclei cannot be easily visualized so the eggs and sperm from mature individuals are collected and it is placed into a separate dry container and fertilization is initiated by adding water and sperm to eggs and with gentle stirring to facilitate the fertilization process since in fish fertilization is external in vitro culturing of embryos and their subsequent transfer into foster mothers is not required next is transgenic chicken transgenic chicken is used to improve the genetic material of make up of existing strains which is concerning building resistance to viral bacterial diseases better feed efficiency lower fat and cholesterol levels in eggs and better meat quality it is also suggested that the egg with its high protein content could be used as a source for pharmaceutical proteins next is the transgenic mice transgenic mice is the most preferred animal which is used for studies and it is taken for studies for the following reasons that is it have short estrus cycle and gestation period relatively short generation time production of several offspring per pregnancy convenient in vitro fertilization etc these are all the reasons uh, for which mice is most preferred prefer preferably used for studies and as a result the techniques for gene transfer and transgenic production have been developed using mice as models subsequently these approaches have been modified to adapt them to other animal species one of the first reports of transgenic animals published in 1982 december involved a trans uh, involved the transfer of the growth hormone gene from rat fused to the promoter of the mouse since then many transgenic animals including those in cattle sheep goat pigs rabbit have been produced for various purposes next is transgenic rabbit rabbits are quite promising for molecular farming which aims at the production of recoverable quantities of pharmaceutically or biologically important proteins which is encoded by transgenes and the following genes encoding valuable proteins have been separately transferred to rabbits and the human genes are il2 growth hormone tissue plasminogen activators alpha 1 anti trypsin etc in addition to these genes bovine alpha lactalbumin lactalbumin has also been expressed and these genes were expressed in the mammary tissue and their proteins were harvested from milk next is transgenic sheep the major application for transgenic livestock is the using is using the mammary gland as a bioreactor and for the production of protein pharmaceuticals in milk transgenic sheep have been produced to achieve better growth and meat production as well as, as well as to serve as bioreactors for example human genes for blood clotting factor 9 and for alpha 1 anti trypsin have been transferred in sheep and it is expressed in mammary tissue this was achieved by fusing the genes with the mammary tissue specific promoter of the bovine beta lactalbumin gene lactoglobulin gene human growth hormone genes has also been introduced into sheep in order to promote growth and meat production the transgenic animals showed improvement in body weight gain feed efficiency lean meat or fat ratio fat composition etc the important objectives of transgenic sheep research is increased wool production and improved wool quality for this purpose genes essential for the synthesis of some important amino acid found in keratin protein of wool have been cloned and introduced in embryos to produce transgenic transgenic sheep for example the genes cys e and cys m for two enzymes serine acetyl transferase and o acetyl serine sulf hydrolase involved in cystine biosynthesis 
were isolated from bacteria and cloned in a vector. These genes were introduced in sheep cells ultimately leading to the production of transgenic sheep where these genes are expressed. Next is the transgenic goat. It is evaluated as bioreactors. Some human genes have been introduced in goats and their expression is achieved in mammary gland. John M. C. Folson and Carl Ebert they produced transgenic goats. They expressed a heterologous protein in their milk. This protein is used for dissolving dissolving blood clots that is for the treatment of coronary thrombosis. A cDNA representing LATPA was linked with either the murin that means family muridae of the order rodentia or a beta casein promoter in an expression vector and used for injecting early embryos obtained surgically from the ovi duct of the recipient females. Few milligrams of LATPA per liter of milk could be obtained from the transgenic goat and at this concentration the dairy goat may become an economically viable bioreactor. Next is transgenic pig. The efficiency of the production of transgenic pig is still very low when it is compared to the production of a transgenic mice. Transgenic pigs carrying the growth hormone bovine and sheep globin gene have been produced. The animal will grow a little faster but it did not become large. This show an increase of 10 to 15 percentage in daily weight and 16 to 18 in feed efficiency which is lower than those in mice. And it is also observed that there was a marked reduction in the subcutaneous fat in some of these pigs suggesting the possibility of producing leaner meat with lower fat content. It is also reported that a long term elevation of growth hormone was generally de detrimental to the health. Next is about the enviro pig. It is an interesting example of trans transgenesis as a way of overcoming the detrimental environmental impact of high phosphate pig manure. In this case, a phytase transgene that is expressed in the salivary gland efficiently removes the phosphate residues from phytate. As a consequent, the phosphorus in phytate become metabolically accessible which enhances growth and so significantly reduces the amount of phosphorus that is excreted. Transgenic cow The annual global requirement of protein C which is used for the prevention of blood clot is about 100 kg. One transgenic cow would be more than sufficient for the production of the annual world supply of factor 9 which is used by hemophiliacs to facilitate blood clotting. Each dairy cattle produce approximately 10,000 liters of milk annually which contain about 35 grams of protein per liter. In Netherlands, a technique has been developed recently for in vitro embryo production. And in this new procedure, oocytes which is obtained from the ovaries of the slaughterhouse, cows were matured and fertilized in vitro. And their pronuclei is micro-injected with a construct containing a bovine alpha S1 casein promoter. And the embryos which were cultured to morula or blastula stages and the non-surgically transferred to recipient females. Two of the 19 calves born from 103 transferred zygotes were transgenic. This procedure may facilitate the use of cows as bioreactors at the commercial level. Next is the primates. The world's first bioluminescent primate was a marmoset monkey which is named anti that means DNA in reverse order and I stands for an inserted gene. Here, the gene for bioluminescence is collected from a type of jellyfish and it is transferred to the monkey which is transgenic and this transgenic monkey will emit light. By using a virus as a vector, the gene is transferred into the ovum and there was a success of 1 out of 222 such experiments. 
ദ നോൺ അവൈലബിലിറ്റി ഓഫ് ഇ എസ് സെൽസ് ടെക്നോളജി ഫോർ മാമൽസ് അതർ ദൻ മൈസ് ഹാസ് പ്രിവെൻറ്റഡ് ടാർജറ്റഡ് ജീൻ ട്രാൻസ്ഫർ ഇൻ ദം നെക്സ്റ്റ് ഇസ് ദ യൂസസ് ഓഫ് ട്രാൻസ്ജെനിക് ആനിമൽസ് ട്രാൻസ്ജെനിക് ആനിമൽസ് ഹാവ് ബിക്കം വെരി യൂസ്ഫുൾ ഇൻ ബയോളജിക്കൽ ബയോമെഡിക്കൽ ആൻഡ് ബയോടെക്നോളജിക്കൽ റിസർച്ചസ് ആൻഡ് ഇറ്റ് വിൽ ഓഫർ എ യൂണിക് ഓപ്പർച്യൂണിറ്റീസ് ഇൻ ആനിമൽ ഹസ്ബൻഡറി ഡയറി ആൻഡ് ഫാർമസ്യൂട്ടിക്കൽ ഇൻഡസ്ട്രീസ് ദിസ് മച്ച് ഓൾ അബൌട്ട് ട്രാൻസ്ജെനിക് ആനിമൽസ് താങ്ക് യു